Hastings appears to be ill at ease. He appeared to. I fear that this case is far from being solved. Come on, Poir. Certes. But how many times will he kill before I do? How do you do, gentlemen? Chief Inspector? I fear your admirer has struck again, Poirot. We haven't yet identified the victim, but it's a young woman, 20 to 25 years old. Death occurred last night between half past 11 and 1 o'clock, and we found an ABC guide on the body. Was she pretty? Come on, Poirot, that's rather out of place. It has no bearing on the murder. Are you certain? For a woman, it is often the most important thing. It often decides their destiny. The body hasn't been moved. You can see for yourself. Has the press been informed? Not yet, but I'm planning to. I haven't yet informed them about the presence of the ABC guide in Andover. Nobody has reported a young woman missing? Not for the moment. No witnesses, I imagine? Indeed. We've asked everybody who may have met a young woman fitting her description last night to come and see us, but I have little hope of gaining anything from it. It's early days, Chief Inspector, and the news may not have spread around the town yet. I hope you're right, Hastings. braided silk belt. It may have belonged to the victim. This key is too small to be one for a house. Without a doubt, it is for a padlock. The guide is open at the page for the Bexhill train times. The young woman wasn't wearing shoes or a coat and was not carrying a bag. That's strange. Either the murderer stole her belongings or she put them somewhere safe. Maybe so that she could bath. These marks have been left by a rope or a breaded cloth. She was a great beauty. Strange that chap didn't notice it. Apart from the marks on her neck, there are no signs of the struggle. She didn't manage to hit her assailant. Let us now try and get our brain cells to work.
poor child must have been strangled with his bread belt. Unfortunately, in view of the fabric, it is unlikely that we will find any prints. Let us now try and get our brain cells to work. The medical officer should confirm that the victim was strangled with her own belt. That's what I thought. She shows the usual signs of strangulation. With a little luck, we'll find prints this time. You are too optimistic, Hastings. Our killer is far too meticulous for that. There is no doubt about it. Bexhill has one of the most beautiful beaches in the air. This hut is locked. This hut is locked. A dual locking padlock. I need to find the code and then insert a key. Thank you. 